Tonight, we're digging deeper into the impact of a major Wausau events cancellation. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bill Aldridge. And I'm Melissa Langben. Wausau's balloon and rib fest canceled again this year. This is Victoria Saha joining us live from Wausau with more on the decision. Organizers say it certainly wasn't an easy decision, but it came down to this, forcing thousands of people to mask up behind me at the Wausau airport while enjoying ribs in the warm July weather just didn't seem realistic. COVID-19 canceling balloon and rib fest for the second year in a row. While it's a disappointing decision for a lot of area residents, it's one Wausau events say they had to make. Masking probably would be required still at that large of event and how nearly impossible it would be to enforce the mask policy. The three day July weekend brings in around 30,000 people and making sure everyone was masked up at all times just didn't seem doable. Some residents say they understand why it needed to be canceled. We are looking forward to something to do. So um, I think that it, it's, it's taxing on people um, and it's hard, but we're just all trying to get through this together as a community. The balloon and rib fest usually collides with chalk fest, making it a busy weekend for Wausau. The local economy gets a boost of nearly $1 million from that weekend alone. It, it's terrible for the Wausau's economy. Well, what dollar price do you put on, on lives, on health, on safety? Um, and so I think that becomes the factor that we looked at. And that boost would have been a huge help for small businesses already struggling to make ends meet because of COVID-19. Chalk Fest is the best for us because it brings a lot of people that's that's been a day or two down here and it's very, very good for business. Terry Koss says business picks up by 50% for him that weekend and he hopes at least Chalk Fest will go on. Now, there still hasn't been a decision on Chalk Fest or Blues Fest, but as for concerts on the square, it could look a little different with limited attendance or even a virtual event. Stick with us for any updates. Live in Wausau, Victoria Saha, News 9, WAOW.